Hey y'all, it's me. I know I've been gone for a minute, but I'm back. Okay, I've been feeling all kinds of crazy. So, I just had to take some me time. Gizmo, stop scratching. Gizmo needs a bath. Because he is going at it today. Whoa. So, this is a haul video. If you don't like hauls, click off now. But it's a spiritual haul. These are some of the things that you need to purchase if you are trying to work in this realm. You want to do some healing, uh, white magic, whatever you want to call it. This is a haul for that. So, I'm going to start off with my Buddha uh, statues that... I found at the dollar store, and you know I bought every one they had. Not every one, but every different one. So I got her, and these are cement. They are heavy. Ain't she pretty? I want her, and then her. I have her. I thought I had her in wood. I got her somewhere else. She's somewhere in this house. I know I have her. And the classic Buddha. And he heavy. These are really nice. I mean, they are extremely detailed. For this to be cement, this is really nice. Dollar store. Dollar Tree, I guess. Yeah, I think it was Dollar Tree. And I, um, see, I told y'all they have candles at Walmart. These candles came from Walmart, and I'm surprised. So, Walmart had the seven African powers. And it has the prayer on the back. See, and it shows the Orishas on one side because, like I said, when we came here, we had to hide the Orishas under the Catholic saints. So, yeah, they sell these at Walmart. So, I got this one, and it has the seven African powers on here. If you want to work with the seven African powers, and I bought this one, which is a legwa. A legwa is always represented as a child. Uh, Santo Mino de Atocha. My Spanish is horrible. But it is on the back. The information is on the back. And it is in Spanish and English. A legwa. Oshun. Cari Dad Del Cobre. And I'm probably not pronouncing that. I took Spanish in the ninth grade. That was a long time ago. And I ain't used it since. And it does have the prayer on the back. Oh, sure. And this one, who is this? This is St. Joseph, which is I got you. Under the Orishas. So, you can have your candles all over your house and nobody not know that you are into Santeria, you you working with the seven African powers, because they not going to, they ain't going to know. They just going to think, oh, well, she likes the Catholic saints. Okay, she a good person. <laughs> she got all these Catholic saints in her house. Yeah. So, Walmart. I think this was 94 cents. And the crazy thing is, I went to the Dollar Tree. I paid a dollar and 42 cents for this candle. And my husband talked about me too. Because when I got to the Dollar Tree, you think Dollar Tree didn't have the Catholic uh, candles for 99 cents? Yes, they did. 
I could have got these at the Dollar Tree for 99 cents. And I'm in the Dollar Tree just throwing a major tantrum. And you think my husband didn't? You really up here throwing a tantrum for like 42 cents? And I was like, no. Check your Dollar Trees. Check your um, Walmarts because these are things I'm, I'm looking over here trying to see did I show y'all all that but I think I did these are things that you need for your practice you know if if you're going to start working with the seven African powers then it would be nice if you had a, at least have a seven African powers candle or something you want to work with the Orisha, start on um, getting your candles for the different Orishas that you want to work with. Now, I might come back later on and we talk about uh, somebody. I think we talked about Obatala last. Um, maybe we'll talk about Yemaya or somebody. I might. I ain't going to guarantee it. And I might not, because I just, I don't know, I just, oh, I've been feeling so, oh, oh let me show y'all this. I got some happy mail. Look what my friend sent me. Did I show y'all this already? If I did, look at it again. <laughs> St. Patrick's Day. Oh, and it is St. Patrick's Day today, too, huh? I got a St. Patrick's Day pocket letter. Ain't that cute? And all of the little treats. Ooh, I, I can use that to uh, decorate some of my little stuff. All the little treats are in the back. And, of course, she sent me a letter. And I got a happy St. Patrick's Day button. A kiss me, I'm Irish, but I'm black. Um, <laughs> button. And some washi tape. And some... Um, St. Patrick's Day ribbon and some sh shiny doodads. This is going to probably make a cute, uh, let's see. I'll make some kind of juju baby and add some of these to him. Or, but yeah, um, I'm into pocket letters. I think I'm going to start making some spiritual pocket letters. And, you know, they going to have little jujus and all kind of little stuff in there. So, if you want a spiritual pocket letter, okay. But check this out. If I send you a pocket letter, you got to send me something. You got to, like, write me a letter, draw me a picture. <laughs> you got to do something now. I'm, I'm nice, but this, you know, this going to be reciprocal. Like, I give you, you give me. That's how, that's how this going to work out, okay? So, if you want me to send you a pocket letter, let me know. But you got to send me something. If you don't do pocket letters, write me a letter. And write me a letter. Don't type me a letter and print it out on the printer. I want you to use a pen. You know what? These uh, Paper Mate Ink Joy gel pens, and I just noticed that they doing commercials for these. These are the bomb. I mean, they write really smooth. The ink don't transfer, unless you got some really thin paper. But the ink don't transfer to the next page because I um, actually use these in my journals because I do do a uh, journal art and they don't bleed through good pens i think like 10 of these was like probably almost ten dollars or ten dollars they i think they was like 9.99 for 10 or something like that but they worked it they they really are worth it i got these from target not being sponsored i paid my money for these okay i'm silly i'm finna go guess my want to go outside Come say hi, Gizmo. I said come say hi, child. He ain't messing with y'all today. 
Come here, Buddha. Lord, you falling in? You drunk? You been drinking? Say hi, people. You want to go outside? You want to go outside? He want to go outside. That's why he tripping. He think the dog next door, his name is Max. He think Max outside. And he be trying to bully Max and fight. Now they both about the, they about the same size. Gizmo ain't no, he's not a bully. Um, he ain't out here beating up chihuahuas and stuff. Because Gizmo's bigger than a chihuahua. But I think Max and Gizmo, they about the same size. They look like they could be cousins. But Max looks like he's got some Pekingese or... Something in him and Gizmo is, um, they think like a Maltese and some other kind of terrier mixed. That's why he all white, but they're not sure. I mean, they, they will run a blood test on him to see what he is, but I don't want to know that bad. Well, I have to pay like $200 to find out what my dog is and I'm not willing to pay $200 to find out what I am. No, he just a cute little white dog. That's that. Let me go. I'm rambling. I love y'all. When y'all miss me, you need to let me know that you miss me. Like, you need to go to Twitter and be like, hey, where you at, girl? Or Instagram, where you at, girl? We ain't seen you. So I know that y'all miss me. Now, I know I have certain friends that if they don't see me, they holler at me on Facebook. I love y'all. Y'all know who y'all is, my sister girls. I got me a couple of sister girls who love me, and I love them. I'm finna go. I'm at 12 minutes. Love y'all.